Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel and uh, well, Moment 2 has finally arrived. Moments are these updates where there's new features added to Windows 11, 22H2. So uh, we had Moment 1 late last year and now Moment 2 has arrived with a cumulative update on uh, yesterday, February 28th. Now one of the first things you should do with Moment 2 uh, when you install that update is to go to your Microsoft Store and make sure that with the Microsoft Store that you actually um, update all the apps because some of the apps that are for Moment 2 need to be updated uh, after that update is um, uh, the cumulative update is installed so that you get the uh, latest features. So what's in Moment 2? What are the new features? Well, first of all, customizable search box here at the bottom as you see. So what you do is if you want to change it, remove it, or change the size, you can actually um, go to the uh, taskbar settings. And in the taskbar settings, search will have four options. Hide, you have the option search icon only. You have the option of search icon and label. And finally, a search box. So depending on what you want, uh, this is the choices that you get that you can check out. And uh, if you want to remove it, you can remove it completely. So these are new uh, settings that are now available for moments. Uh, so that's the uh, search box that you can personalize. Then you have the uh, options of the search in the file explorer that is apparently improved and much faster than before so if you ever want to search for something on this on a pc and so on you can now find apparently things better it's more, more efficient and faster than before you also have search options that are available and you have closed search so uh, these are changes that have been happening now to uh, the uh, the uh, tasks the uh, file manager or the file explorer of the uh, of the um, Windows operating system if you have a tablet uh, there is a better optimized tablet mode that now actually makes things a little easier including with the taskbar so it's optimized for touch devices they uh, also have a um, Windows Studio um, effects, but this is almost nobody has this. You've got to have a computer that has an MPU in it. If you have an MPU in your PC, then uh, the effects can happen. For example, in Zoom and so on, you have some st what's called studio effects. But this, almost no PCs actually have that. So um, that is one of the things to know here. The uh, widgets uh, tablet, the widgets uh, actually has now a full screen mode. So if you go here on the uh, widgets and uh, check out the uh, double arrow, you'll see that you can have full screen widgets. Uh, better widgets, also more efficient widgets, apparently. So these are some of the options that are available there. Uh, you see that there's a new video option that's available, apparently. Uh, that's not sure exactly why you want that or what it actually does is bring you on, on the website anyways. Uh, and soon to be third-party widgets uh, that are going to be a possibility for the, uh, the widgets panel. Now, you know, a lot of us probably don't even want the widgets anyways but anyways full screen mode is available and you don't have to have a microsoft account anymore to actually have the widgets working so this is something that was available before the uh, task manager if you right click and uh, start button and go to the task manager task manager now will support a search uh, for a process so when you want to search for something, you'll have type of name, publisher, or PID to search. So you can now search processes within 
the task manager, which is something new also that is added here within the uh, task manager. Uh, in the, um, there's also new uh, personalization settings, um, by the way, in the task manager also. So when you go to the task manager, once again, you could see that uh, there are some options available that you can personalize um, in uh, in here so that you can change things around if you want and so on. Uh, so these are also new things and new settings that are available in here, including uh, the way that it's actually going to run and follow the you know, light mode, dark mode, and so on. You also have some improvements in the energy recommendations or changes. So uh, if you right click, for example, here I have laptops. If I right click on the battery and go into the power and sleep settings, or if you have a desktop, you can go into the power and sleep settings. One of the things that you'll see is a new uh, panel that says, or new option says energy recommendations. And if you click here, it's going to tell you what you should do to save power and you can apply these changes if you want. So these are new things that are available for power efficiency. So, uh, and there's of course a link now that you can trade in or recycle your PC and uh, that you can uh, check it out. Improve voice access in the accessibility. So that's one of the things that could help a lot. There are bonus wallpapers if you are using the Bing wallpapers that you can get um, in the uh, operating system. So if you uh, want, if you're not using a custom, um, you know, wallpaper like like I do or a set of pictures, uh, when you go to the settings and go to personalization, there will be in uh, the uh, background pictures updates of. Uh, new types of backgrounds that you might want to have if you want. Uh, so depending on the background pictures, uh, new stuff that will apparently appear in these uh, choices for your operating system. So you see here, I've got a black screen. Uh, I don't know if it's a refresh that I need. I remembered something about that. But anyways, I'm going to go back to uh, my standard wallpapers that I had before which uh, I actually like better. And so um, just choose whatever customized uh, wallpaper black that you want. And here we go. So these are some of the changes available in the um, new Moment 2. We'll take a look a little more in detail of some of these features also in uh, next videos. So Moment 2 has arrived. If you want it, it's an optional update. You can go and get it, and or else it will install itself with the uh, Patch Tuesday security updates in March. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us a thumbs up. Thank you for watching.